Okay, what we're looking at is the new Radius M18 Lantern from Milwaukee Tool. I got it in the uh, center of the gazebo here, and as you can see, it casts a, uh, a bright light at a pretty good distance. Right, today I'm going to do a review of the Milwaukee 2145-20 Radius Light. Uh, it's a new product from Milwaukee, and this is a really neat piece of gear. One of the first things you're going to notice is that it's really heavy. Uh, without the battery, it's 10 pounds, 12.6 ounces with a 5 amp hour battery. Uh, it brings it in a little over 12 pounds, so uh, you're going to notice it when you pick it up. It comes with a carry handle, which snaps into place because uh, there's a good chance uh, you're going to hang this from a rafter or from a wire or something. You can hang it this way, and then there's also uh, another place to uh, hang it right there. And you can, there's spots on here for you to hang it up. It's pretty nifty. Uh, with the tool only, you get the light, like you see right here. You do not get the battery. And it also comes with the security cable because someone is likely to want to borrow it without asking. The control panel has uh, three buttons right here. Uh, what this one does is it allows you to turn the light on or off. Uh, you can either like have one half lit or the other half lit in either direction. The top is always on, and this is just a power button. And then this allows you to alternate the uh, three different settings. There's a high, which is 4,400 lumens, medium is 2,100 lumens, and low is 1,000. This is the fan, uh, as I said, this is the 5 amp hour battery. Milwaukee says it'll run 2 hours on the 4400 lumen setting. I got 2 hours 4 minutes, and I got an hour 35 minutes with the 4 amp hour battery. At the medium setting, it's supposed to run 4 hours. I got 4 hours and 3 minutes with the 5 amp hour battery, and 3 hours 24 minutes with the 4 amp hour battery. And then it's supposed to run 8 hours at the 1000 lumen setting. I got 8 hours 23 minutes. I didn't do it with the 4 amp hour battery. One of the I things that makes this light special is it's a hybrid. You can use 110 or the battery system. So you can plug an extension cord in here and then you can string up to 12 of these in a row uh, using additional extension cords. At 300 bucks a pop it's going to get expensive in a hurry if you want to string a bunch of these in a row. But uh, it's a pretty nice feature to be able to use the battery or an extension cord on this thing. It uses their true light LEDs that gives you that nice uh, natural looking light and as you can see it really is bright. I've been using this light for a few days and uh, it's really amazing. Uh, definitely uh, worth looking into. Uh, the only really bad part about it is the price. Otherwise everything about this thing is awesome. It's uh, IP54 rated so it uh, should uh, be good against dust and light water spray. It's not waterproof, but uh, yeah, it's a nice heavy package and it's a beautiful light. 